Hey guys, Turquoise Husky here, and welcome back to Stories of My Life. This is part two, uh, and today we'll be talking about um, one of my favorite subjects uh, in my life. Um, when I got ran over, but um, hope you guys enjoy, and uh, I'll see you guys in a little. All right, so let's start off with. Uh, the setting. It was during winter whenever I was three. Okay. And, uh, you know, we were all getting this snow just to go up to the snow and build a snowman. And, uh, you know, this was before our neighbors down there moved. And, um, so I fell and then what had happened next will surprise you heck. but um what happened next was uh probably the most uh painful experience of my life but um I have stories of this in every single class I have um either I got ran over or I got hurt but um yeah <sighs> so yeah um so it's winter you know I'm three um I fall uh then what happened next was uh my dad he was backing up in the Kobota um, which is a tractor, basically, but, um, he was backing up in the Kubota, and, uh, you know, the back right tire, I believe, or just the back tire, um, he was backing up, and I fell right behind him, so, uh, So he was backing up and he sees this hat on the ground. He doesn't know whose hat it was, but you know, he yells, uh, asking whose hat is that? And then what happens uh, is he's backing up and uh, my head is right underneath the tire. Or right underneath yeah, the, the, tile, the tire. But, um,. So he keeps backing up, and that's when my mom yells at my dad because I'm right behind him. And so it's a huge problem because my dad ain't here. So I got my head, I believe, on this side, right here side but um my head you got uh you got uh ran over I guess you could say but it wasn't really the tire just barely scraped my head and so it was uh a very bloody experience and um then what had happened was I had, I had to get rushed to the hospital because they had no idea what to do. And so... My dad, he was driving while my mom was in the back seat of the car. Because my dad wouldn't be able to handle uh, blood. Because my head was blushing. Blood, you know? Um... So I got, drove to, so I drove... So my parents drove me to the hospital, and uh, so my parents drove me to the hospital, and my parents drove me to the hospital. I'm in the hospital ER, uh, getting a CAT scan to see if anything was damaged, but um. 
then like an hour later the results come in and uh, my parents are there just sitting you know with uh, a bear and um, so it's a uh, you know a teddy bear it's a pretty small teddy bear if I can find it I'll show you but um, she, was, she was also like holding a soda I think I think it was Pepsi I don't know, but um, and then, so the results came in, and uh, my parents were relieved that nothing bad had happened to me, but um, and then what had happened after we left the hospital was, we went to a restaurant, I don't know where the restaurant is, or what the restaurant was, but um, we went there, we ate, and then we went home to spend the rest of the day in the winter. So, uh, yeah. Um, I'll go and find that bear. Alright, so, uh, here's the bear. So, uh, yeah. And so, um, that's the bear I got because of uh, me getting ran over. And can you imagine that I'm 14 now? It's been 11 years since that happened. Dang, that's a long time. Th that means this bear is 11 years old. Or, is, yeah. But, uh, it's still intact, except for that string there. But other than that, you know, it's still intact. Surprising. So, um, yeah. Um, that's all I can remember, really. So, uh, I have stories about this. I can read one, uh, if I can get in. I might be able to. So, um, I'll go get, I'll go and read that. And so, uh, All right, so unfortunately I was not able to find the text or the essay, whatever. But uh Yeah, that's it. So leave a comment if you want to know any thing about this uh subject in my life, about the story of my life. But um like, comment, subscribe. Um also click that bell notification right next to the subscribe button you do that you're set peace